the Lega State House Marina, where Lagosians await the COVID-19 updates from the number one citizen of the state, Governor Babajide Somodu. After almost five weeks of the lockdown, activities will gradually resume in Lagos next week. First, the big question. The curfew and the ban on the interstate travel directed by Mr. President. There will be an overnight curfew from 8 p.m. to 8 a.m., except for essential services. This means that from the hours of 8 p.m. to 8 a.m., we will expect all Lagosians to stay in their homes from the 4th of May 2020. And it's a form of good news for businesses as the governor announces resumption, but not without precautionary guidelines. More stores and markets in Lagos. All open markets and stores will be allowed to open from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. on selected days. Um, apart from the economic issues that Mr. Governor has spoken about, there are some medical reasons. Um, with the complete lockdown, we're beginning to see uh, levels of uh, lack of nutritious food and malnutrition. Um, that is the perfect situation for the virus to infect people. A malnourished body is not able to withstand the infection. And what would be the fate of religious organizations, institutions of education and entertainment centers? On education, all schools and institutions at primary, secondary and tertiary levels will continue to remain physically closed. Students are expected to continue learning alternative online and media channels as announced by the various institutions of learning. All places of worship, be it formal or informal, will remain closed. For as for from any form of congregational service or assemblage until further notice. Our Muslim brothers and sisters taking part in the Ramadan fast must observe their meal and prayers within their homes. As businesses gradually open by Monday, wearing face masks is also very compulsory. We are encouraging businesses in Lagos to commence the production of face masks as we roll out our new campaign to mask up Lagos. Currently, 1.5 million households have been tested. As the move to curtail the spread continues, the governor assures that one more million families will be tested in the coming days. Mary Chinda for Plus TV Africa.